So this is what the public facing site would look like, and it looks good. However, if we click the contact link, we get this access denied. If I gave you one guess as to what was going on here, would you guess permissions? If so, you'd totally be right. So if we want the public to be able to use these contact forms, we need to give them permission to use it. So let's go back to the page where we're logged in as an administrator, and let's go to permissions. Let's do a search on the page for contact. And here we go, use users personal contact forms. So we need to enable this for both anonymous users and authenticated users. One thing that's interesting to note about the anonymous user and authenticated user roles is that they don't combine. Either you're anonymous or authenticated. So if we gave just anonymous users this permission, as long as you were logged out, you'd be able to see the contact form. But if you were only an authenticated user, you wouldn't be able to see it. So that's why we're checking them both, just in case someone's logged in and wants to use it. And go down and save this. And now let's jump back to the incognito window and refresh the contact page. And now we see the form.